The stage is set and the prospect mouth-watering. Two teams at the peak of their powers ready for a battle royal, serving as a true gauge of their ability to perform under pressure. Only one team can come out on top. Who will it be? This is EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Racing Club de Lens versus Arsenal. Yes, cheers Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubt in they're the underdogs. But if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cup tie and maybe even a massive surprise. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Determined defending. And this is the Arsenal starting eleven. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Kai Havertz starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. And using his strength to shield the ball, Grady. And he did well to cut it out. Gabriel Martinelli. And Ketia has it. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. But he was on his toes to win the ball back. Medina Fulgini David Machado Ball with Diouf Shemiswa Frankowski Salis Abdul Samed Well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball Grady Frankowski and on the ball Danzo now relying very much on their passing game in a bid to take the lead El Yuwahi smuggled away Moving the ball forward with purpose. Now well, disappointing end to the move. And Kessia. It's with Erdogan. Crossing opportunity. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Fulgini. Well, a really good run. Ball with Juf. Textbook defending inside the box. Alexander Zinchenko. Rice with it. Kai Havertz. Declan Rice very alert defending to cut off the supply into the advanced position Duth big chance challenge of the highest order Bukayo Saka Ben White 
Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? Fugini. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. What can they do from here? Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. White. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Well, shielding the ball admirably. Oh, but they've lost it now. Martin Erdegaard. Rice with it. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdogan. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Grady. Salis Abdul Samed. Shemiswa Frankowski. And ball back with Arsenal now. Declan Rice. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. And beating the defender. Kevin Danzo. Went in strongly to win the ball. 30 minutes to go then. Thomason. Grady. Frankowski. Kevin Danzo. Lovely tempo to this passing sequence. Thomason. Diouf. And now Thomason. A oh, super piece of play. A good and fair challenge. Martin Odegaard. William Saliba. Bukayo Saka. Now with Havertz. Gabriel Martinelli. Alexander Zinchenko, an encouraging Arsenal move. Could go ahead! Still could put it away. Not just the tackle that was needed. Intense pressure. Chemiswa Frankowski. Samed Frankowski and on the ball Danzo Salis Abdul Samed Wahi looking for that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead he cuts it back just the clearance that was needed Martin Erdegaard. Rice with it. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdegaard. And he read it well. Salis Abdul Samed. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. 
they believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Five minutes remaining, and level pegging here. Kai Havertz. Salis Abdul Samed. Chemiswa Frankowski. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Well, that's the end of that move for now. Given away by Arsenal. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, good run and good ball control. Must take the lead here. Oh, that is a wonderful piece of challenging. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides. the ball rolling again no end to the action it's the first period of extra time and I must say this has been a back and forth type of game Thomason can he put them in front that is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances Well, he says only not alone, and reading it absolutely superbly. Alexander Zinchenko. Rice with it. Martin Odegaard. It's with Gabriel. Kai Havertz. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. We wondered if a goal would arrive. Well, now it has. And will there be a response now? Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Kevin Danzel. Samed. Chemiswa Frankowski. Thomason. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Ben White. And here's Saliba. So at the halfway stage in extra time. And 15 more minutes left. And away they go again. Second period of extra time has commenced. Strength and control, a big part of his game. But just like that, possession changes hands. Gabriel Martinelli. Kai Havertz. Rice with it. Gabriel Jesus. Could be threatening. 
And quick thinking defensively. Chemiswa Frankowski. He's using his strength to good effect. Teammates in the middle. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And defensive play to be applauded. Time is fast running out. Five minutes left in the second period of extra time here. Oh, good-looking run. Well, not so fast. Did well to make amends. There will be one minute added on at the end. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. Oh, in with a chance. Reading it well. He might be able to carve something out. And players waiting in the centre. And that is full-time, really, the worst possible start, you've got to say. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out.